the eyes of the world have been glued to the city of Haran for the past two months, following the outbreak of a previously unknown pathogen. It is not yet clear what has caused this gruesome affliction. The local government's Ministry of Defense erected a quarantine wall shortly after the outbreak. The global relief effort's steady stream of supply drops has sustained what few survivors remain in the city. The Ministry of Defense believes more radical action should be taken to stem the tide of this virus. The question is, are there still non-infected survivors in the city as the GRE maintains? And if so, will the Ministry still go through with a stated plan to annihilate the city in an attempt to wipe out the Haran virus once and for all? Whether by way of the virus or the Ministry's proposed plan, one thing is certain. Haran's days are numbered. HUD activated. Commence briefing. Approaching Haran. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. Jump in 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back!
You pinch him. You're scared. I'm not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Alright everybody, welcome to Dying Light. This was a recommended fun through from a lot of you guys wanted me to give this a give this a go. So it was on sale on Steam, so I thought I'd try it out. What a beginning that was, huh? Not not on the ground like 15 seconds and we're already getting attacked. We got bit. Does that mean we're a zombie now? Are we gonna play as a zombie? I don't know. This is um this looks like a cool game. I did a little bit of research on it just to see what it was all about before I bought it. But a lot of you guys, I asked what you guys would like to see, and this was um, pretty heavily recommended. So we're going to try it out. And so, I don't know. I'll, what I'm going to do is um, we're going to go through and depending on, you know, the comments, the likes, if you guys like the video, make sure and hit the like button. That way I know to continue with this one. If not, uh, we won't continue on if you guys don't like it. But we need to give it a shot. It is, after all, a zombie game. Let's get to it. Um, we turn on. No, it's a radio. Turn it off. Now, hopefully I don't get any hits on this. After all, this is a Warner Brothers game, and I usually get my most hassles from them. But Batman's coming up too, so we gotta get this thing straightened out. Anybody knows anybody from Warner Brothers? Tell them, Meaty's okay, Meaty's okay. Alright, let's see what this game's all about. Whoa! You sleep for three days like a dead man, then scare children? Off to a great start, 31. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Paradise? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will brief. Ow, did he just punch what do you me? You mean 31? Ask the boss. Did he just punch me? Alright. I don't know if he punched me or not. It seemed like he did. 31. That's your number. Excuse me? Your number. You're the 31st infected. I'm the 18th. Everything is counted here. One fewer doses of antizen. One more new infected. One more runner gone. Alright, we'll see how this That's thing plays through. We'll probably make this first episode a little bit longer so we can get an idea of the game. And, um, I was curious when I was doing some research, I looked at some other big YouTubers who play. Man, and they do like 12, 11, 14 minute episodes, man? I was like, what's... You get a lot of views on that. I don't wonder if I should make really short episodes like they do. I don't think so. What's up, hey, Derek? Where's room 190? Upstairs. Upstairs. All right, I can't run yet. We're just getting picked Sick off. Bay. One by oh, here one. we go. Upstairs we go. Meaty's in a zombie game headquarters. Hi. So I'm far. looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. Go on in. Stop calling me 31, dude. My name's Meaty. My name's Meaty. Can we steal anything? Can you steal stuff in this game? I. Th you can craft. Um. You can craft stuff. I know that. Oh, here we go. Hello? Excuse me. Hey, I'm looking for the... Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? Yeah. No, I... I do, actually. You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Knee bone? Your Anderson was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. Yeah, I need my radio, man. You know why runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antisin meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. Hey, don't talk to me that I've way. I lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. 
Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, Jeez, rude. be fair. I'm not, I'm not lazy. I'm just, hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Roger that. So if this guy's stuck on the 13th floor, is this tower not completely secure? I'm not lazy, you little shit. Yeah, exactly. Okay, check for lost survivor on the 13th floor. Do do do. Workshop? Can't go in there. Guards? Can't go in there. Check for the lost survivor on the 13th floor. Where do you think you're going? The 13th floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. 13? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our way out here, huh? Oh, here we go. Oh, nice, dude. Elevator time. We don't have to take the stairs. <laughs> so if this is... Let's see. Let's check this. Oh. Oh, Jeez. dude. How many people died here? This is the tower they live in? Oh, do we have to look in the baby carriage? Dude, what in... All right. Crane here. Where were you? We've been waiting for your report. It's been over 70 hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry, my cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. I'm taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisent ASAP. No! Help! Somebody! What the hell? Oh, pipe time! We got ourselves a pipe. Let's get in here. Where was he at? Can we? There's got to be stuff for us to pick up in these places. No, no. We're, oh, I can sprint now. Oh, here. I didn't even look at the map. Oh, there's a flashlight. Nasty. Oh, dude! Oh! Zombie? Where's this dude at? I cut my arm getting away from him. Oh, God. You sure he didn't you bite you? Look at that him, tub, dude. You? It's full of blood. God damn it! That was... That was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh, shit. 31? You went after Mark? Is it... Is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Right the junk! Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> All right, Mark, what's hey, up, hold dude? still. Lena will be here any minute. Goss! You've got to find some goss! Goss! You and alcohol! What, you want to drink? Find them. That will stop the bleeding. Please, hurry! I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. All right. You guys, keep in mind that most videos, most games like this, take a little time to get going, so... I'm sure we'll be getting into some heavy stuff here pretty soon. What is, that? what is that? Metal parts? Okay, we are collecting stuff. Whoa. Press Q to use your... What did that say? Oh, what was that? Survivor sense? Nice, dude! Oh, there we go. Uh, apparently not. Dude, I like this... Oh, duct tape? I like this survivor sense thing. Okay, so there's a building over here. Kind of marks it. Kind of marks the stuff in your general location. Nails, okay. Refrigerator. Nothing. Oh, booze. Alcohol. All right there. Oh, I'm stuck. 
No? Is there something else here? Oh, I almost missed that. Duct tape. Okay, we got this area. There was another zone over here. Yep, I see it. I see it, man. Hey, I was already in this place. Wasn't I? What's that? Something purple. Gauze, got okay, it, coach. Okay, I think that's everything I'm gonna find. Let's give this a shot. Duct tape. This must be to craft stuff. What's this purple thing? Electronics. Craft part. Okay. Oh, jeez. This room is full of stuff, huh? How do you turn I to blue? Oh, I have a flashlight. Took a couple of buttons to figure out where it is. Sorry for the darkness. What is that? Tin can? Alright, press I to enter blueprints. I. Blueprints. Med kit. Do they want us to craft him a med kit? You need to craft a med kit before leaving. Okay. Craft it then, chief. Okay, apparently that this is our, our crafting menu here called blueprints. Then we got skills, survivor, agility, and power. We've got our inventory, quests, and maps not available yet. All right, let's get back to this dude. Where is he? Hey, where'd my pipe go? Did I drop my pipe? Oh my gosh. All right, here you go, bud. Med kit. Med kit. <laughs> Uh, that looks like a bite, dude. <laughs> okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes an alcohol, huh? Mm. Pretty primitive, but it'll work. That's right, it'll work. Lady. <laughs> lady. Thanks She's my help. one and only lady. I'll take lady. care of him from here. All right, roger that. You guys see I have subtitles on for you? That way sometimes, because I end up talking Oh, what I get? Plus 250 something. Well done, 31. You stop calling me 31 there, Frando. Hey, 31. Dude, call me 31. I'm a new guy. Perhaps I misjudged you. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you can, can we go do back that. up the elevator? Yes, we do. Jam up the elevator. I want to go outside, because this is supposed to have, like, Parkour, it's almost like a zombie Assassin's Creed because you gotta jump on buildings and stuff, I guess. All right, now that we got this thing, we can search for stuff up here. Do the old zoom as we go. Whoa. All right, what are those guys doing standing there? Here I come to save the day. All right, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Ooh, I'm like an errand boy. Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and yeah, tell thank you how you, sorry Jade. I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. <laughs> nice. No explosives, Rahim. Why not? Explosives are cool. I like explosives. All right. What do we so, got, brother? So, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. I think it's kind of walking us through some of the stuff that we're, you know, the options that we... What did he say? Oh, 194. Workshop, still can't go in there. 194, I'm in with the guards, dude. Anything in here I can steal? Braxo. Oops, this isn't Fallout. Near, near, near. Oh, here we go. Player's stash. Okay, hint. This is your player's stash. You can change clothes here as well as leave any items for storage as your new survivor rank increases. You will access, get access to new outfits, okay? Fresh clothes. Enter. Changing my clothes. Okay, apparently we got fresh clothes and storage. 
Uh, I guess we'll just hold on to this stuff for now. Okay, Raheem, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. Up to the it's gym? It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. Alright. The stairs are over here. Up to the gym, huh? Oh, are they gonna see if we can train? Bedroom? Where are these guys? Anything in here? No? A lot of... Who are these dudes? I don't think there's anything in these rooms for me to steal. Let's go up to the gym. Let's get... Maybe we'll go outside. There we go. Nice. Oh, jeez, that's bright. <laughs> Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Close. Close. Oh, crane time, huh? Jeez, dude. Well, what are you waiting for? Get over here. Is he over there? Meet Raheem on the... Oh, on the other... Oh, look it. There's an arrow here. Okay, parkour basics. Press and hold space to jump and grab the ledge you're looking at. Remember to look at the ledge you want to grab. You can perform this action while standing, walking, and or running. Hood! <laughs> Who are you? I'm following the arrows. You want to feel right at home. A crane on a crane. A crane on a crane. Congratulations, dude. You're hilarious. Dude. Look at this place. Whoa, dude, this city's huge. Do we have access to like all the way over there? Oh my god. I had to take a look, dude. That this place is crazy looking. Graphics are solid too. It's an NVIDIA game type thing, so it's pretty good. Welcome to our gym. First things first. You've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, all right? Now, jump down to the very bottom. What? Are you nuts? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Woohoo! Ah, Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! What? Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down what here! What is it like? Christ Mattresses? On a crutch. Mattresses do Press and hold space to jump and grab the... What'd that say? Jump and grab the ledge. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh. Holy shit! Trash bags. It's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. That's good. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. All right. Let's do this, friend. Follow the arrows, huh? Sometimes it's better to crawl through the low, narrow passages. Okay. Eaters will have a tough time following you. All right, we're doing good. Running through the building. Okay. Arrow. Try not to slow down once you start running. Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. Oh, jeez! <clears throat> I think my... Hold the jump button, don't release... Oh, okay. Oh, I just messed up. Try again? What? I already messed up. All right, so I wasn't running, I guess. There we go. Not bad. For a noob. I'm a noob. Oh. Get me up there. There we go. Nice. All right. Get up on that scaffold. And don't fall cuz there sure as hell ain't no net. Okay, this way. Up That's my here. favorite. Cat grab and muscle up. You won't survive outside for 10 minutes if you can't do that. Okay, to here. Look at the other ledge. Press forward. Space! Nice. Up. Okay. Space! 
Okay, we're good. Good job. Okay, time for the real test. Get back to the crane. Make use of anything and everything while Pass you Pass the run. parkour test. Alright. Hoot! Alright, we got a little walk here. Arrow time. Nice. Okay, that's enough. You've got some serious natural talent, man. Yeah, I do. Hoot! Either that, or you've done this before. You've done this before? Yeah, Hardly. I play Assassin's Creed. The closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. <laughs> well, then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. What? That's not nice. Good. <laughs> Five hundred. It must be like skill. Whoa, geez, what is dude. What's happening to me? Shit. Shit. Oh, shit. Right, I'm turning into a zombie. Zombie! Something went wrong. Raheem. What just happened to me? Dude, I'm gonna fall off this thing. Oh shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Just get back over here. Dude, I'm gonna fall off the... Oh, look at my hands! Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm a zombie. Brains. Brains. Oh jeez, dude. Oh, there. I didn't... I couldn't move for... Ow! Trash pile? Oh, I should have jumped onto this. Okay, note to self. Hey, buddy. I don't feel good. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely, no. At least not yet. Seizures reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera, though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. All right, quartermaster time. Quartermaster, that's usually weapons, right? All right, where are we going? What do you get from me, Down. Oh, those are. Oh, it just shows door doorways. All right, elevators. Elevator time in your city. All right, down the elevator we go. We're gonna go see the quartermaster. Then we're gonna go see some doctor to give us a shot. All right, they've given me an actual job, and nobody suspects I'm not I, who I say I am. So far, so good. And once Dr. Zaire helps me manage those symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better. J -j -j jam All right. Where's Dr. Zira? Do you think he's outside? Level 1. Well, this doesn't make sense. Why is level 1 okay, but level 13 wasn't? Is that weird? Is that me? just me, or what? It's a battle journal. Quartermaster. Oh, you're the new scout. That's me. Rahim radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. What is that? A By the way, word around the table? tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food or antizen. By which I mean, the people here don't much like you. But don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Right. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though, and you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Game changer? Oh, I'll bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Yeah. Also? If you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. What? Keep you warm at night. Woman time! <laughs> Alright, give me this, this thing, this table leg. Quartermaster, items in stock. Take? We can just take them? Oh yeah, nice. Alright. So what did that give us? We have... Can we make anything? Med kit. Zero. No. Inventory. We have a pipe, which is 24 damage right here. We have a gas pipe, which is 24 damage, and a table... Table leg of 19 damage? The deuce. We have duct tape, electron... All right, let's get out of here. Exit. Stage left going outside yeah yeah apparently leaving safe zone 
Okay, new guy. Be careful out there. We've lost too many already. Whoa, it's bright. All right, where are we going? We got to go out. Why wouldn't the doctor be inside the tower as well? Okay, noob. You've got Dr. Zera set up in a semi-trailer on a fenced in plane court. When you leave the tower, hang a left and head due south. You can't miss it. It's Crane, oh, kid. All right, all right. Crane. Just keep moving. There's no time to take in the sights. Where is it at? Oh, this and way. And try not to make too much noise. Sound attracts those fuckers. Don't make too much noise. Stay on the move. Okay, I got you. Uh, was, oh, there's a chest thing right there. Saw that a mile away. Alright. Anything else around here? Where are we? Oh, right down there. Wait, there's an arrow and an X. Alright, go this way. Hood! Oh, there's zombies right there, dude! Our zombie time! There's another crate. Blade. Ooh, that thing looks... Oh, dude, we're gonna be making some crazy parts. What do we got in here? This... There's gotta be something good in this big thing, right? What do we got? Chemicals. And coffee. Delish. Oh, jeez. Alright, that wasn't good. X marks the spot. Alright, entering safe zone. I like these safe zones. These are cool. Alright, let's look around a little bit. See if there's anything delish in here for me. No. I Nothing? Hope those rotting What's that? Never figure out how to climb on top of a van. Here we go. Get a shot of Antizen from Dr. Doctor? Zier. Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Uh, so... I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called Antizen. Suppresses the symptoms here. Sit. Antizen postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable? So th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's rabies? No cure right now. Am I a dog? But you see, I've been running tests on both Antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible. Definitely possible. Oh shit, you really think you can figure it out? With Dr. Camden's help, yes. I think so. Uh, now where did I put that injector? It's in my hand, Who's buddy. Who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero, where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio, though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit. I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat. Meat! Leaving That's them me! Around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't? Uh, it bore no fruit. I'm ashamed that I wasted so much time on it. No reason to hold any antizen in reserve now. In any case... Alright. I'm quite busy, so on your way now. What was I doing? <laughs> He's like a scatterbrain. What was I doing? Alright, so we got our antizen. Check mark. Sent most of his best people to Raheem, Zara checked me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Not out to hold you. For a while. Which is good. Cause I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Go talk to Spike. You'll find Spike. him near Zeta's truck. He's got the first real job for you. Alright, first real job. First assignment, get a job from Spike. Hey, survivor rank up. Survival... Where was that at? Oh, skills. Hint. You have a skill point. Well, thank you, that's why I'm here. Uh, survivor, one skill point. What do we get? Survivor rank gives you access to supporting abilities, blueprints, and gadgets. Increase survivor rank. Complete quests. Help other survivors and participate in challenges. The higher your rank, the better the equipment offered by shops. Okay. And we get the survival starter kit. Learn how to craft the most basic things needed for survival. Lockpicks, firecrackers, simple throwing stars, and Molotov cocktails. 
I don't mind if I do. Nice. All right, you guys, I think we've gotten, like, an idea of what the game's going to be. Looks like we're... You picked up a blueprint. Search for components to craft this. You've learned how to craft firecrackers. Okay. And you learn how to craft throwing stars. So it looks like we're going to start doing some stuff outside now. So I would imagine next episode would probably really get a good feel about what it's going to be like out here with the zombies. So if you guys are interested, make sure you like this video. And, you know, tune in for the second episode so we can really see this. Again, I'm going to be looking at your comments and the like ratings to see if you guys want me to continue on with this series. So far, it looks really cool. Uh, I'm curious to see just how tough the zombies are going to be. So next episode, we're going to find out. All right, guys, thanks for watching.